Bryce, we all want a good night's sleep, and you have the mattresses for us to get that. Yeah, we, we really do. Um, we've carried this brand called Restonic uh, for close to now, well over 30 years and almost 40. Um, a lot of people say, why would you carry Restonic? That's a brand I haven't even heard of. Um, the reason is, is their customer service is very difficult to beat. Um, if if you have a problem and I can't get service from the manufacturer, that's going to be difficult to get my customers happy. So and Restonic always takes care of both me and you. As well, yes. Yeah, so it hands down can't be beat. Okay, and it's comfortable, and it's it's because of the springs. Do you want to talk to me about this Restonic spring system? Yeah, so Restonic, um, the biggest complaint on any manufacturer is support. How is this bed going to give me support? Unfortunately, most of our weight is in our hip area. And so they've constructed, Restonic has constructed a, um, a system that's called um, the Comfort Zone um, or the Marvelous Middle. Um, in the middle of the bed, so from an area right here, mm -hmm. they've constructed um, more coil springs in the middle of the mattress. Now, once again, the, re the reason for that is it's going to give us extra support and extra strength, which we need. Um, so even when you're told to rotate your mattress, you're still keeping those coils in the center and you're still maybe rotating. Is that still recommended? Uh, yes. On some beds, yes. and some beds, no. So just depending on which one you get. Mm -hmm. And then, as you can see, it's got this, what they call a foam edge support system. So all along the edging of the mattress is going to give you support. And the reason for that is it's going to give you more of a sleepable surface. Um, and if your partner is a bed hogger <laughs> and it pushes you right to the edge of the bed, it's going to give you good edge support without it breaking down. Well, so. And quite often you're using the edge to sit on as you're putting your shoes and whatnot, so you're not going to tear that down to where you have that slump yeah. and you're going to fall off. That's right? exactly right. Exactly right. Um, another feature that um, some of the Restonic beds have is this. It's called a microcoil. Um, what this is, is just like um, this mattress right here, you can see they've got the pillow top or this Euro top to it. A lot of beds, they just put foam, uh, memory foam, latex, things like that. But the advantage to a microcoil is it's 50% stronger than foam and it's 28% cooler than foam. So if you're a hot sleeper, this would be a really cool feature for you. Well, that's fantastic. My husband does. He gets hot in the middle of the night, and I'm over there freezing all the time. But he, <laughs> that would be a great thing for him. Yeah. And Although this, we do want to sleep together. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. We don't want that to go away. <laughs> um, it's kind of like its own ventilation system. It's not going to be air conditioning. It's just going to allow your bed to breathe. So once again, if you are a cold sleeper like you, this isn't going to make you any colder right. at all. So a really cool feature. Um, and with it being stronger than foam, um, the chances of your mattress um, flatting down or having body impressions are not likely with the micro um, with coil. That. OK, and that's interesting too, because you can go into people's homes and you see these big, huge you know, divots or whatever, and that's because they don't have this kind of a system yeah. helping support that mattress. And then going back to the reason why we carry Restonic is if you do have that problem, if you buy a Restonic bed, we're going to get you service. Isn't that fantastic? Well, you've been selling them, you said, for 30 years, so you've been taking care of the community for a long time, and you obviously are still continuing. You know it's a good company. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Exactly. Okay. Now tell me the difference with what this is. Okay, so this is another bed that they've got come up with. Um, it's four different types of foam in, in the mattress, so there's actually no coil springs in it. Um, and then on top, which I don't have handy, is, is latex. Now the advantage of latex is it's antimicrobial, so it's going to have no, yeah, it's, it's, it's just going to be able to be a, a, a great feature. It's kind of like memory foam. I'm sure everybody's had a chance to play with memory foam where it molds to you. The advantages there is it molds to your body, gives you that um, built-in custom fill. But, late, but the problem with memory foam is it is heat sensitive, mm -hmm. so it, it can heat up. Well, that's what I have felt when I've tried that is I feel a little bit, well, I'm claustrophobic, uh -huh. so I really like the feel of this, but there are those people that love it. So yeah. there's pros and cons, but I love this mic antimicrobial aspect to it because we're all looking for that kind of a thing, germ-free. Yeah, yeah I hate to say it, but everybody's got something living in their bed, yeah. no matter how clean we are. 
So the advantage of latex is you still get the benefits there, but it's not heat sensitive. So. Okay, well rest on it right here. You and I, Bryce, you always have the best deals as well as comfort for us as we sleep. Thank you. Thank you, Bryce.